the Plague Doctor. It's an outsider, and their ability is, if you die, the storyteller... Let me try that again. If you die, the storyteller gains a not-in-play minion ability. It's loads of fun. Uh, we've sorely needed extra outsiders for a while now, and this is just one of those classic... Uh, tools in the toolbox of storytellers where you can balance things out uh, and you get to give yourself a lot of free reign to do that with. Uh, I'm going to hand things over to Ed and Jams now so they can go through the minutiae while I drink this uh, Belgian beer that my girlfriend brought me from uh, Paris. Go for it. Cool. Um, this is a relatively easy one to explain like the basics of because essentially when the Plague Doctor dies you put a minion character token in the middle of your grimoire uh, on the app there is now a way to assign a character token to your storyteller because that's a fun thing that we needed before now. Um, so <laughs> you can now assign yourself the uh, whatever minion ability you're getting and you'll get the, the tokens accordingly. Um, if you're playing in person, you just put whack it in the center of the uh, circle of the Grimoire to remind yourself that you have a minion ability and then you just use that minion ability as if uh, you were that minion for the rest of the game. Uh, it's important to note the storyteller doesn't become evil they're not a player, they can't be targeted by abilities, they can't vote or nominate, they just get a minion ability that they're going to use, uh, mostly for fun. Um, but generally, you know, it is an outsider ability, you are trying to harm uh, harm the good team that little bit with it. Um, if all minion abilities are in play, they can gain an in-play minion ability, because who doesn't want two poisoners? And uh, if the Plague Doctor is poisoned or drunk when they die, the Storyteller doesn't go gain an ability and is presumably very sad. Uh, the ability does work for the rest of the game. It's not a one-off. Um, the important thing about this script, uh, this this character, and especially in the script that Ben has written showing this off, is you'll notice normally we don't do characters with very many jinxes on the reveal script. Um, Steve and I had a good time writing jinxes for this. <laughs> the Plague Doctor is a great character to write jinxes for. Um, because there's a load of characters that aren't fun. You know, the storyteller gains the spy ability. Oh, wait, you mean they can look in the grimoire? Whoa. Um, so instead, there's a bunch of jigsaws that basically make uh, all the characters which don't do anything otherwise fun. So uh, the marionette, the goblin, uh, the scarlet woman, the spy, the widow, the baron, Wim Dandy, and the baron. Uh, have all got jinxes to the Plague Doctor and uh, the o the only w oh, and the evil twin. Um, the only one which is an, what we would call a negative jinx, which is a you can't do this, is the evil twin because there's no fun way of putting an evil twin ability in late game. All of the others are fun. Um, so <laughs> we'll just, I mean, we might as well use the example. Please do go through them because bit. this is such a great example. A lot of the time jinxes are like a band-aid. When it comes to this character, the Jinxes are its most fun interactions. So you might as well just take us through them, Ed. Cool. Yeah, someone has already asked uh, what the Baron Jinx is, and that one is my absolute <laughs> oh, favourite. Yeah, uh, yeah, it's so yeah. good. So, I should, yeah, let's start with that, because the Baron is probably my, my favourite as well. Uh, if the Storyteller gains the Baron ability, up to two players become not-in-play outsiders. Uh, so you know that rule we have where uh, square brackets don't happen mid-game? Yeah, they do here. It's more fun. Um, so, so that's the Baron ability. Uh, in the same spirit, um, if, uh, the, if, the, if it's Fearmonger that the Storyteller would gain the ability of, uh, rather than the, the Storyteller gaining that ability and not being able to use it because the Storyteller can't nominate to trigger the Fearmonger ability, a living minion gains the Fearmonger ability in addition to their own and learns that. Same with the Goblin, gains it in addition to their own. Same with the Scarlet Woman, gains it in addition to their own. Same with the Spy, gains it in addition to their own. Um, the, only other, the only ones that vary from this are the Evil Twin, um, which is just the storyteller cannot gain the evil twin ability. We couldn't find a fun way to make that one work. Soz. Um, I'm, I have got an idea for that, which we might try and do later down the line. But for the time being, uh, don't. Oh, no. <laughs> we lost him. That's his uh, regular Ed. 20 minute wait, wait, we got him, Virgin yeah. Media getting booted out. Welcome back, Ed. <laughs> yeah. Um, so don't give yourself the evil twin ability. <laughs> I'll just carry on as if nothing happened. Um, and then the last one is the boom dandy. Boom dandy. <laughs> <laughs> if the Plague Doctor is executed and the Storyteller would gain the Boom Dandy ability, the Boom Dandy ability triggers immediately as if the Plague Doctor had been the Boom Dandy. <laughs> um, <laughs> I didn't see that one. That's brilliant. Yeah. <laughs> 
So yeah, I was saying before uh, this game to some of the players in this that uh, I'm really proud of some of the stuff that I've done in the Clock Tower <laughs> world. Um, I was really pleased when Steve got me involved in writing almanacs, and like I was really excited the first time uh, I actually wrote some almanac entries and like wrote a quote for it. And then we got to writing these jinxes, and it was like, no, this is great. This is the most fun I've ever had uh, writing stuff for Clock Tower. Okay, uh, so bluffs. Uh, we've got... So let's give the baddies bluffs that they can actually... So Engineer's a good one. Uh, Night Watchman's good for confirmation. Probably Dreamer is going to want to be kept around, so that's a good bluff to have. Uh, I don't think we need to do any other setup except for the Steward, uh, who's going to start knowing one good player. And I'm going to make that good player... Ooh, I think Jojo's probably a good shout there. Not too powerful. Decent bit of confirmation. Um, yeah, let's have the Librarian once again see the Plague Doctor. Or... Mm, let's go with Jacko. Okay, cool. We're ready to start. Start by visiting the, the minions, I guess. Hello. Hello, you are the pit hag. Oh, come on! Okay. <laughs> is, that, is that bad? Is that, I, I would be I, delighted to no, learn that. No, no. You, I heard the P, and I was like, oh my god, am I to play that? Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> You are not, but you can uh, you can mess around with one. I, I can potentially, ooh, I can potentially add in play doctor. You could, I'm, yeah. If I'm pretty sure it's already in. <laughs> uh, well, your fellow minions, milk. Your demon is Malashan. Milk and Malashan. Cool. All right. Enjoy. E. Hello. Uh, you are the Scarlet Woman. Ooh, that's fun. Your minion is Malachi. Okay. Your demon is Malashan. Exciting. Well, that couldn't possibly have gone better. I know, right? Enjoy. Bye. Bye. Hello, oh. Malashan. Hello. Oh. Uh, so, you're the Vigor Mortis. Okay. Your minions are Milk and Malachi. Okay, thank you very much. Alright, good luck. Thanks, bye. Bye. Okay, here we go. Now it gets interesting. Oh, I need to go back and give bluffs. Do that in a sec. Hello. Hi. Uh, right, you're the philosopher. Ooh, very fun. Okay. Do you want to use it? Um, I will hold off for a day. Okay, cool. We'll hopefully see you tomorrow night then. Hopefully. Bye. Bye-bye. Okay, I'll just give the demon their bluffs here. Um, this character's not in play. Uh, Rima, there we go. Okay. Whew. So with a pet hag, the plague doctor can die multiple times. Ben, how many powers do you want? All the powers. Unlimited power. Okay, who's up next? Librarian. Good Hello. evening, Bunny. Good evening. So, uh, if you've not already been told, you're the librarian. Excellent. Oh, sweet. <laughs> yep, nice and easy one. No, no, all, all socials for you. So, uh, either Jacko, your neighbour, or Ed, sat across from him, mm -hmm. is the Plague Doctor. Excellent, thank you. You're welcome. Okay, now Jacko's going to learn a disturbing truth. Hello, Hello Jacko. You, the empath, learn that one of your living neighbours is evil. Evil! Thank you, Ben. You are welcome. Hello. Hello, Alejo. You, the steward, learn that Jojo is a good player. Okay, thank you very much. You're welcome. I actually think this is quite a uh, a strong setup for the good team. Uh, this is interesting here now because we're at, there's actually two of us, uh, and we have to agree as a, as a as a pair 
uh, what we're going to say to a general. And I don't know if Jams and myself have differing ideas of whether or not the good team starts off winning, but I always consider the good team to begin the game winning. Uh, and so with no, unless something crazy happens on night one or the general's getting misinformation, it's almost always a thumbs up from me. What what, what do you do, Jams? Oh, yeah. I, I mean, this is something that I've talked about with um, quite a few people. But yeah, good team. It, it's a good sided game. The good team almost always starts off winning. I'd say barring like a really nice poison or something on the first night, it's very rare for yep. the evil team to start off with the upper hand. So I think just a nice little good. All right. That's nice and easy then. Uh, let's yeah. Let's get Jojo in here. All right. <clears throat> Hello, Jojo. Yo. General Jojo, uh, Jams and myself have conferred, and we believe that the good team is winning. Deal. D D I'm, glad, I'm glad you agree. <laughs> All right, cool. Uh, that's everything. Um, there's nothing else that needs doing. I'm assuming you've informed everyone of their characters. God, this is very 2020, isn't it? Like we're playing on Discord. <laughs> Gotta go around and tell everyone what they are. <laughs> yeah. Um, I did. I think I, I, I was watching who you were talking to. I'm pretty sure I got everyone you hadn't talked to. Did Samantha use her ability tonight? No. No. Okay. No, uh, and I think you would have seen the token go up, right? Had it happened. Yeah, probably. Um, who knows what happens on the staging server? <laughs> 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 Alright, um, yeah, in that case, I think we are ready to rock and roll. Alright, let's do it. Good morning, everybody. According to the local <laughs> vicar, the plague's come into town. So lock your doors, hold your loved ones close, because a bloke with a weird mask is possibly going to be causing God to gain some weird abilities. Let's go. <laughs> I'm the plague doctor. Wait, is this how we're supposed to play it? <laughs> <laughs> it's 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 I'm the plague, plague doctor. doctor. Kill me. I believe it. I believe it. <laughs> That's the good thing, is you would believe it. I'm muted. That makes sense. I heard of that character. <laughs> uh, I'm here to ask you a very straightforward question. Are you the plague doctor? Yes. Okay, cool. I just wrote down I, the word yes. That was very good. Don't kill me. <laughs> Alright, cool, cool, cool. Thank you so much. I'm the librarian, hey. so... Oh, you I confirm me. You. Yeah. Is that right? Yeah. Wonderful, wonderful. Yeah. Do you want to roll, roll swap? No, actually, no. No one will believe me if I'm the librarian. <laughs> yeah, no one will believe you. That's actually really meta. Um, but you can be the librarian. We can get into a double claim or something. Nah, they'll kill a double uh, claim. I don't mind. I really don't mind. You really don't mind dying? Yeah, it's fine. It's probably going to be good for the stream. Uh, I'll just say I saw a mutant. Uh, Bluss were engineer, dreamer, and night watchman. I went engineer and claimed to have Kate created a witch and a marionette. So if you could maybe turn Milk into the witch, that would be awesome. If Milk is not the witch already. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What was the other two buffs? Engineer, uh, dreamer, night watchman. Dreamer, night watch. I'll say I got the ping uh, if you want to claim that watchman. Um, you can honestly, with me. honestly, I I think I'll just go rogue because I think you want to kill me anyways. At some point, probably yeah, late the night. So yeah, okay, sounds good. Yep. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, I'll I'll tell that to Milk and I'll ask him what he want or what he is. Okay. Right. Cool. Thanks. Cool. Bye. Wow, this has already started off very entertaining. I can see the I can see the plays building already. That's great. Um, yeah, well, Bunny's definitely a mutant, just straight up hard claimed me, so. Nice. I'm a double claim, not hard claimed. Yeah. What are you? Uh, I'm the juggler. The juggler? Well, juggle me then. Then yeah, you'll be I able will. to trust me. Yeah. Yeah, I will. I think I will. Probably juggle Bunny as the mutant, too. So, jumped. Oh, you no. also what? I also made a mistake. But oh there. Oh well. Uh, so <laughs> what do you want to do? Uh, don't mind. Um, uh, I will do anything anything at all, actually. I've not been doing stupid questions because I haven't got the brain space for it, so you tell me. Alright. Um, let's do a stupid question. Okay. Um, if oh, you... Uh, go I wanted to go first. How dare yeah, you? Uh, if your character was in a scary movie, how soon would they die? 
Uh, oh, really? Ooh, like quite that's late. A good one. Like yeah. really quite late. They like, can't hear me, but let's be real. He would like be the last, villain of that not scary final movie. Three or four, but like real. This is the real turn of the plot. Like it's this is the moment where it looks like it's really gone off the cliff. Um, sort of phase. You know, end of the second act, setting up the big third act. Um, All right. If your character. Um, have you got the default background images on on the tool? I have the uh, default, yeah. Yeah. If your character was walking through town and saw the the lady on the the background image, yep. what would they? How would they react? Um. That's a that's a that's an interesting question. Because <laughs> like, how would anyone react? Uh. The, the, I think that they would have a pretty typical reaction. Nice. Nice. Alright! Well, I'll leave you to enjoy your delicious Yeah, I'm just gonna keep eating chicken. this fried chicken as much as possible. I'm doing great. Uh, what can I do for you? Uh, I'll tell you what I've been telling people, uh, which mm -hmm. is that if my character were an evil character, <laughs> yeah. it would be either the goblin or the, the marionette. That's good. Um... Uh, and I will tell you that I'm probably the philosopher. Okay. Yeah. Probably the philosopher. Got it. Yep. That's what I'm going with. Cheers. All right. See you later, ho. Great. Well, uh, in that okay. case, in that case, probably goblin. Okay. I'll, I'll turn gonna you. That's going to sell out Malachan, so you're going to need to make yourself into the Scarlet Woman later. That, that's the problem, though, is that I, I bluff a uh, uh, soldier to Ekin. Mm. Roger Nora's a soldier, so you got a problem there. Uh... <laughs> I mean, you can leave me as a Scarlet Woman, but they're just going to kill me after Malishon. <sighs> Wait, why would they kill you? Hmm? Oh, because I'm going to look super fucking evil when I claim Goblin. <laughs> okay, I... I, I... Hey, what? Just eventually make me into the Goblin, okay? I, I think I had to do, do it tonight. <laughs> Don't forget, lads, if you can kill no. the Plague Doctor, you can be both the Goblin and the Scarlet Woman. <laughs> well, that's really good. No, no, that's actually really good, because it needs to be a not-in-play ability. So I need to not be the Scarlet Woman when the ability happens. So we definitely yeah, want so to make that... me into not the Goblin. So actually, you can make me into the Poisoner, so I can either catch Goblin or Scarlet Woman, or you can catch Goblin or Scarlet Woman. Oh, jeez. Okay, make me the Poisoner. Why can't... I'll poison Ekin. Okay. Okay, okay. Oh, yeah! Yeah, yeah, that, that works. Okay. Alright, cool. Bye bye. Yep. Okay. Probably another minute, then we'll then we'll open noms, I think. And someone immediately double claimed me, so I think they're the um, correct ping, because they were in my pings. Of mute. Oh! Well, then. Yeah, I think we should leave that person alone. Yeah, exactly. Alright. Cool. Alright. Thanks. Thank you. Let's do this. God damn it. Almost had a full grim. Almost had a full grim. Nice. Hey, Malachi. What's up? You can you can juggle me as the soldier. Okay. Okay, welcome back everyone. Me as the soldier. Twelve hey, players jugglers. alive. Uh ju accepting juggles first, I guess. Oh yeah. Okay, I think Avery Sand was up first, so we'll go clockwise from there. Um, I am the Plague Doctor, but I will juggle as a bluff, of course. Uh, and I will juggle that uh, Malachan is the Exorcist. Milk? Sorry, uh, the Engineer. I'm sorry, wrong E name. The Engineer. Malachan's the Engineer. Milk as the Scarlet Woman. Ed as the Soldier. Jacko as the Librarian. And Alejo as the Steward. Okay. Uh, Malachi? I'm going to juggle Ekin as the soldier, uh, Ed as the plague doctor, uh, Reznora as the uh, soldier, Malashan as the engineer, and Samantha as the dreamer. Okay, uh, Ekin. 
I will juggle um, Avery as the Plague Doctor, Malashan as the Engineer, uh, Malachi as the Lycanthrope, and Jacko as the Librarian. Okay, I like the little kiss that you gave at the end there to Lil Monster as well. That was adorable, Aww, man. That's <laughs> some effort. I would like to juggle Alejo as the Goblin, Jacko as the Librarian, Buddy as the Mutant, Avery as the Plague Doctor, uh, and that's it. Okay, Ed? I don't actually want to juggle. I just want to share some interesting information. Um, I've had someone hard claim to be a non-Plague Doctor outsider, which is functionally hard claiming that it's a little monster game because there's no way it's a bigger mortis bigger mortar game with only one outsider and Ben's not put the Plague Doctor in. Um, so, you know, fill your boots. <laughs> okay. Nominations are open. I would like to juggle Ben as all of the minions and Ekans <laughs> Baby as the little monster. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I've been eating fried chicken. Can I do a juggle too? <laughs> Please do. Um, I would like to juggle myself as the goblin five times, please. Okay, thank you. Any nominations? Uh, Mal I'll, I'll juggle, okay. actually. Uh, I'll juggle Ed, Malachan, Milk, Avery, and Jacko as the goblin. Okay. Nominations. Malka nominates Ekin. Okay, tell us why you've nominated Ekin. Uh, just from their hard claim to me, I kind of, I'm going off of meta read, I kind of find it hard for them to be what they claim to me when we have the Plague Doctor in, in this game. Okay, Ekin? I am what I told you, um, and not a good kill, so do what you gotta do. Alright, six votes if you disagree. High five, Malachi. Oh, High five! Fuck, I didn't try five. Not enough. <laughs> I did my best. Sandwich. Did you try five. Jacko nominates milk. <laughs> Jacko nominates milk. Tell us why. Uh, Ed pointed out it seems unlikely to be a Plague Doctor game, in which case we would like one. So if we go for this goblin, we can re rack and get one. <laughs> okay, milk. <laughs> <laughs> Did you just claim goblin milk? That was so fast. I'm the goblin. I'm the goblin. <laughs> you eat like a goblin. <laughs> All right, yes, um, milk is claimed both goblin fried chicken and also goblin. <laughs> just Pickled radish. It's really good. He's a goblin goblin. I'm a goblin goblin. <laughs> gobble gobble. <clears throat> six is enough. Milk on the block with six. What are we doing killing your goblin, day one? I don't know! Who's Getting the green flag? <laughs> I didn't vote. I didn't Trying vote either. Courage. Yeah, nobody's gonna panic for this because I'm the goblin, so it's gonna be great. Uh -oh. I'm panicked. Final call for nominations! Nope. I'll nominate you! Who, was that Resnora who said that, sorry? Uh, Samantha, Samantha nominates Jacko. Samantha nominates Jacko. Tell us why. Um, Jacko is claiming a role that is a double claim, and also it's a role that he claims every game. So, probably not true. Um, and also wouldn't be a terrible kill, even if it were true. Okay, Jacko. I stand by my previous norm. Okay. Six to tie, seven to die. Great idea and running this, Jacko. I love this nope. plan. Mm. Six is tie. Seven is die. <laughs> Seven is enough. Jacko on the block. I love Jacko's plan. I nominate myself. Yeah. Alejo nominates Alejo. Tell us why. Eh. Let's make it interesting. Alejo? 
Okay. Eight to die now, seven to tie. Sure, I'll take an extra ability. That sounds great. <laughs> it's not right. enough. Not tying it, Jacko. Jacko's still on the block. Yeah. No, this is going to be a good game now. <laughs> <laughs> apropos, apropos of nothing, if the pit hag could turn me into the goblin now, that would be really helpful. Thanks. Calling it in five. Four. Three. Bunny will nominate Malachi. Two. Bunny nominates Malachi. Tell us Mela why. I think Ekin was being honest in the claim that they gave you. And I think you wanted out of the game for reasons. Go for it, Malachi. Uh, again, if Ekin was actually honest about the claim, I find it really hard to believe it would be in this game. I think, I think anyone would. That's why I nominated Ekin. Uh, this wouldn't be an interesting kill, unfortunately. Okay, if you disagree with that, eight required. Still not enough. Bringing the day to a close in five, four, three, two, one. Jacko is executed and dies. Everybody goes to sleep. Set me in jams. We're awake. Wow, right. Milk is putting in a shift already today. <laughs> My favorite thing about this day is that the juggler has correctly juggled a minion and incorrectly juggled the demon. <laughs> yeah. So um, I'm a bit a bit worried that Samantha's going to go juggler now as well. And <laughs> didn't take note of any of those juggles. So let's go find out what she's choosing to do. All right. Hello. Hi. Would you like to use it? Uh, I was trying to decide. Um, I, th I think I'm gonna go with yes. Okay. Um, yeah, I'll just, I'll just do Dreamer. Okay, Dreamer right. it is. Uh, good choice. We'll be back. Yeah, see you later. Ho hopefully. Okay, yeah, good. Oh, Jams is gone as well. <laughs> I'm so used to leaving that I'm yeah, just I know, right? like, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, sensible choice that was. Uh, we're gonna have to think yeah. about what we'll show. Um, yeah. I think Samantha will probably pick milk, which is bad. Well, it depends. Um, because if milk is pit hagged into the goblin, it's it's not the worst. Um, but we'll see. Yeah. yeah, we will see. Well, we'll see literally right now. Let's go see what Malachi does. <clears throat> Hello, Malachi. Oh. Oh. I'm going to make you a, an offer, Malachi. If oh, at any no. point you make a new demon, I will almost certainly kill the Plague Doctor. Ben! <laughs> hold on. Ben, hold on. Ben. Every... T the last... You don't understand this, and I, I think you just made my entire play group just either cheer or just groan in misery. The <laughs> last two times I was the pit hag or had a pit hag on my team, I had them ha made demons. Like, we played SNB and had all four demons in the game. <laughs> <laughs> I, yeah, sure. Um, uh, when I target... When I target somebody as the, the the little monster, what exactly happens? Uh, good question. I believe that that person turns into a minion who is babysitting little monster. Uh, do you know that, Jams? Do you know the answer to that? Um, I believe with little <laughs> monster you don't actually target a person. You just say, I would like to create little monster. Um, and then whoever the current demon is becomes a minion. And they are no longer that demon. I mean, that is that would be a delightful situation within which to show off the plague doctor, right? 
<laughs> two two new minions in one night. That would be amazing. <laughs> and one of them is us. <laughs> I mean, I mean, I, I, I'm going for it. Uh, <laughs> sure. I create a little monster. Okay, fantastic. Uh, thank you, Malachi. Mm-hmm. Uh, <laughs> just can, can can I make a request for Malachan's new minion? Sure. Why not? We uh, might honor it. We just, might not. Please be the goblin because I don't know what else. I don't know how we're gonna survive. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I will keep that in mind. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Okay, we're, <laughs> we are being a little bit naughty here, but the purpose of this game is to show off a character. Mm. So, what do we turn Malashan into now? I was gonna say, well, okay, I, it depends what we want, honestly, for later. Um, because I, I have a lot of thoughts. I, we could make Malachan the goblin. Um, I will say Malachan seemed to be heavily leaning into bluffing engineer. And I don't think an engineer would claim goblin if they were going to be executed. That's so true. Yeah. I don't know if that's <clears throat> worth it. I also think, like, if Malachi lives for even one more night, like he can turn anyone into the goblin quite frankly he can yeah. turn himself into the goblin he could turn milk into the goblin so i would lean slightly away from turning malish on specifically into the goblin just because i don't think that lines up socially like if i were a good player in this game and malish on, who played the first day the way that they did all of a sudden claimed goblin i would just be like you're the goblin okay but, but that's me so yeah I think your um, mic might be rubbing on your clothes a bit there, Jams. I'm oh, no! Okay, I'll just, I'll just do this. It's, uh, okay. I left my good headphones in England, so... <laughs> oh, no. Uh, yeah. Well, here's what I think we should actually do. I think we should turn Malachan uh, into either the Poisoner or the Witch, and either like give poisoner. kill Ed and give us one of the other two, or kill Ed and make whoever neighbours the person that's babysitting a little monster into an evil marionette. <laughs> Oh my god. Um, I think I think with Little Monster, and this is one of those weird ones because I know that the, the proper entry for Little Monster isn't done yet, I think you technically just have the demon hold it. Like the person who was formerly the demon holds it the first night and then they get to choose after that. Yeah. I might be wrong, but I feel like that is how it is run. I mean, that seems um, fair to me because then we turn Samantha into a, into a marionette. Oh my god. So, so Malachan becomes Poisoner. And we make Samantha the marionette. <laughs> yeah, Malachan is babysitting little monster. We kill Ed via Plague Doctor. Uh, well, we should also check. I know deaths are arbitrary, anyways. I before we decide who to kill, I kind of want to go check in with Ekin and see who he's going to target. That's a good point. Because I feel yeah. like okay. it would be nice to know all how right, that I'll, informs. I'll undo that for a sec. Okay, so first okay. of all, we have to inform Malachan that they are now the poisoner. The poisoner and yeah. also holding the baby. We then go over to Ekin to see what he wants to do because that matters. Uh, yes, so, I yeah. think so. Let's speak to Malachan. Wow, awesome. this, is, this has already been a long night. We're only at the <laughs> beginning of it. Hello, Malachan. Hello. Uh, you are the poisoner? Uh, you are also babysitting okay. Lil Monster. So what was that? <laughs> you're the poisoner and you're babysitting Lil Monster. I think we may have lost. Oh, okay. Yep. Yeah, sounds like you got a bit of lag there, but yeah, enjoy. Uh, Come back. It... Think well. Yeah. All right. See you later. Okay. Thanks a lot. Don't think uh, Malachan right. lives very close to Central Europe. Right, let's go see what Ekin does. <laughs> Hello, Ekin. Hello. Woof woof. Who's it gonna be? Uh, I was uh, I was worried I was getting pit hagged or something <laughs> um, <laughs> from the long time to visit. Um, I think I'm gonna woof woof at Malachan because I do believe their engineer claim. And I'm trying to keep this Plague Doctor alive as much as possible, so we'll see. Okay. <laughs> Malashan it is, thank you. Thank you. Okay, so since deaths are arbitrary, that overrides the lycanthrope, right? Yeah. So, so I think I would lean towards killing two people, just so it's very obvious. Yeah, absolutely. I think one of those two people, well, obviously one of them's got to be Ed, right? Yeah. 
should the other one be Ekin, or should we leave Ekin alive and kill somebody else to show Ekin that uh, Malashan did not die because not because well to yeah Ekin will That's know that it had nothing point. to do with his ability, right? Yeah. Well, I don't know what Malashan is claiming to have changed minions into. Um, if they haven't said anything, Pithag is certainly something. Like, you know, Pithag doesn't have a great win rate, so. Yeah. Um, yeah, I, I would lean towards killing two people here, but maybe something like the steward or. Yeah, the that's exactly what I was thinking. Yeah. Adam Alejo. Cool. Okay. Cool. Uh, so now the question is, which minion ability do we give ourselves? If we give ourselves uh, witch, then we can curse people. Uh, if we give ourselves goblin, then we give one of the minions the goblin's ability. Uh, if we give ourselves marionette, then we make one of the current demon's neighbors the marionette and evil. I, I mean, just for the pure fun of it, like, selfishly, I want to go witch. Because it's <laughs> so fun to be the witch as the storyteller. Um, Let's do it then. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay. So if I if Great. I change my character, I'm assuming it's not going to change it for everybody else. Here we go. How we, funny we, would that we be? are the witches. <laughs> <laughs> we are witches. Okay, okay cool. Uh, right, so. Here's your YouTube title. <laughs> yeah. um, okay. Um, Great. Who should we witch? This is uh, so fun. Um, <sighs> I think it is we, our turn. yeah, I think we witch, I think we witch Avery because I feel like Avery's gonna get their juggler number and then start swinging at people. Mm. Ooh, interesting and silly question, but do we? And we'll have to check in with Ed with this later. I think for fun, we should just let our ability run free. But I think I, the the technical part of my brain is like, well, I think the witch because the witch would go. The witch would pick before the plague doctor would have died in this strange night. Good that point. Yeah. So we don't actually get a use of it tonight. To to yeah. That. No, you're right. I that, want to though. <laughs> the almost identical <laughs> situation happened in one of my playtest games where yeah. I was so excited to give myself pit hag that I accidentally used it a night earlier than I should have done. So you're absolutely right there. We don't get to do anything at all tonight. Um, uh, but we should. No. Yeah, it would be nice, but we're, <laughs> but we're not going to. Uh, yeah. So that means we give Avery their info, give Jojo their info. Uh, and visit Samantha? Indeed. Okay, let's get Samantha in here. Hello. Hello. Uh, who do you want to dream? Uh, so let's find out if Milk is the goblin. Okay, uh, you choose Milk and you learn either Night Watchman or Scarlet Woman. Great, thank you so much. You're welcome. Bye. If they wanted to convince Samantha <laughs> yeah. that she was the marionette, I think that's the info that's going to do it. So someone has said no poison uh, in chat, and you need to have a look at this here. So we've already had, we're past the poisoner's point in the night order. So even though Malashan has become a poisoner, they don't wake up and poison anyone until the following night. Yeah, this is one of those interesting ones where there is quite a lot that actually matters with the Night Order here, because if you run things, you know, there are lots of things that are sort of interchangeable. Like, we could go to the Dreamer, the General, and the Juggler at any point tonight, and it wouldn't make a difference. Things like knowing when the minions are going to use their abilities and when uh, when they are able to use them in case of a pit hag are actually pretty relevant on this script, so. Yeah, Absolutely. Right, we've had a pretty long night, so let's tell Avery yeah. to, and I think we both agree that the good team is still winning this, right? Yeah, I think that's good. Probably a bit more so. Hello. I'm alive? You are indeed alive, uh, and two of your juggles were correct. I claim to be the Plague Doctor bluffing juggler to everyone. How am I alive? Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. The answer to that question, of course, is Little Monster. Let's get Jojo in here. Yo, Hello. Yo. Jojo, uh, we are still of the opinion that the good team is winning. I don't believe you anymore. <laughs> okay. Well, I don't believe you either. <laughs> yeah, stop lying, Jojo. Yeah, come on, Jojo. <laughs> what is this? Liars, all of you. Liars and cheats. <sighs> People lie right. in this game. I don't believe Okay, you. bye. Bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> 
Okay, right. Well, that's it, yeah? We don't wake anyone up. Uh, and the general's last in the night order, so we don't need to pretend that we're waking anyone up. So let's go back to town. Good morning, everybody. It's been a rough night, I'm afraid. The plague didn't arrive, but death did. To Alejo. And dead. Oh, oh, Ben, really? What, what are you talking about, Ben, really? I'm just a, a, a observing the rules of the game, Ed. I think oh. that Ed is the Philo Plague Doctor. I'm not the Philo Plague Doctor. But, you what know, you? Don't, don't worry about it. Nothing happened. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> cool. I really like that you said, oh, Ben, really, as if it was only Ben's decision. Oh, he's gone. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, Ed. Yeah, Ed. I'm, I'm being peer pressured. I'll have you know. All right. What would you like to share today? Uh, just a night. <laughs> <laughs> just a just a just a regular regular old night. Are you sharing yeah. your info? Not yet, because uh, yes, it's very real on script night. <laughs> oh fucking! Oh, we got pulled back. <laughs> yeah, it looks like everyone got booted for a second there. Hell, the demon that I'm the soldier. Great. There's a lot of soldiers, so that'll help a lot. Yeah, I bet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, actually, the goblin. Yeah. I just okay. thought I'd do it a little different. Like usually, everybody's like, "Oh, you know, not the goblin. Just try, you know, hide the whole game." Come on, let's just play it up front. Why not? There's no imp here. I don't have to worry about that. And if it's a little monster, you guys will probably figure it out. So why not just play face up goblin, right? Fair enough. That's great. It hurt. Yeah. Okay. Plus, Are you holding you know, the baby plus it right means now? That you know. Plus, it means that you know no one else has gotten the goblin ability uh, through the plague doctor dying. So that's powerful too. That's fair. That's fair. That's yeah, I'm not holding fair. the baby. I'm not holding the baby today, um, but maybe tomorrow. You never know. Okay. Sounds good. Bye. All right. What? Well, fun. Uh, yeah, it's a little fun. Uh, God, I don't know what to do. I guess. It, uh, yeah. Yep. Weirdo. All right. Bye. Bye. <laughs> And it doesn't actually have the impact of the, the like drawback of minus one outsider. So I, if I were evil, but I would want to change. Can it you into can bigger. you pit hag a little monster into anything? Because they're not really that token. They're something else. Uh, well, I think. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, Ben, but I think you can pit hag a minion into the vigor, and then the little monster just goes out of existence. Yes, exactly. And okay. the other way around, you just pit hag a little monster into the game. The person who's currently the demon becomes a minion. And is given little monster. Yeah. yeah. So that's what I would do, just to take control over the night kills from the storytellers. Um, mm, yeah. Uh, all right. Well, cool. Thanks. All right. Thank you. See ya. Cool. Okay. Bye-bye. That makes that easy. Thank you very much. Okay. Social deception game. Ah. <sighs> At least you're not the marionette. <laughs> I don't hear both of my neighbors are dead. Uh, what team are you on? Right, I'm leaving chat with you two because I need the toilet. Be entertaining. Okay, we'll, we'll, we'll entertain them. Be entertaining. Um, chat, what are you wearing today? Is that weird? <laughs> collectively. Well, just, just start spamming just, the What are they collectively wearing? Yeah. yeah. Right, there we go. Super weird. Um, and <laughs> ben is never going to leave chat with us again. <laughs> <laughs> okay, half of chat, tell us what you're wearing, and then the other half, tell us the smelliest thing you've ever smelled. He's Ooh. never gonna figure out what this <laughs> He's is. Like, what the fuck is going on here? <laughs> do it, chat. Do it. Uh, I'm and then, good. Yeah, okay. <laughs> um. So I hear that you're librarian confirming Jacko, which is just rude. Yeah. Okay. Um. I thought that you were the mutant, which is why I hard claimed mutant to you. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> because Weird. that's what Jacko told me. That's fun. Yeah. We were doing a thing. Um, sure. Jacko said it's okay if I share this, that he is the plague doctor. And we were like, yep. great. Uh, Milk's not the goblin. It's fine. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, no, he's definitely the Scarlet Woman. Yeah. No, so we should probably not kill him today. Are you good? Are you good? Are you evil? Yeah. I'm the Philo Dreamer who oh. dreamt milk as the Scarlet Woman. Oh. Done. So we should probably kill him. <laughs> but what if Ben, the storyteller pit hag, made a demon change? <laughs> uh, I would have gone Just after the pit hag. Oh. So I think we're good. Okay, fair. I, I do think that, yeah, if there was a... I think that they probably put into play... That is a hard double claim. Well, yes, but I'm the one that's dead in order actually, for the, <laughs> for the storytellers to get the ability. <laughs> actually, the other person who just claimed that to me happens to be dead as well. Oh, okay. In that, I claimed it to Alejo as well. They can... <laughs> yeah. It wasn't Alejo. <laughs> Well, okay. oh, if it's Jacko, then I really don't mind. That's fine. I hope we were interesting enough for chat. Oh, I, I wouldn't know. I wasn't there. Welcome back, everyone. Uh, there are now nine of you alive, so five votes required today. Uh, taking nominations and philosopher juggles now. I would like to put a small amount of information before the class. Um, I was perfectly prepared to give Ben and Jams the benefit of the doubt. And then two people died, including me, which means that it's absolutely guaranteed uh, that they actively chose to kill the Plague Doctor. There's, there, there's no hiding behind pretending they put a Vigor Mortis in play and that they killed me. No, no. Guaranteed that Ben and Jams chose to kill the Plague Doctor. So... What do you mean? Have fun. What are you talking about? I, I decided yeah, I, I, to honour the choice of milk the lycanthrope uh, as well as kill another person. Yeah. Sounds right. Um, Ed, so you were the plague doctor? Uh, well. With the lycanthrope in play, does Pithag ignore lycanthrope? Pithag uh, overrules lycanthrope. Yes. If a Pithag okay. creates a demon, then all kills, including a lycanthropes, are arbitrary. Okay, it is worth. It is worth saying that if uh, Ed was the Plague Doctor and Jacko isn't, then there is a player who is claiming to have put minions in play on the first night that does that do not include the Plague Doctor, which doesn't work in Vigor Mortis or Little Monster Worlds. Um, they can't be poisoned, and, the, and if they're the drunk, then the player who I assume is claiming Snitch is also lying. Um, um, you yeah. meant Pit Hag when you said Plague Doctor, but yes. Sorry, put Pit Hag, yeah. Um, if Jacko is the pit hag and Ed is lying, sorry, it's the plague doctor, other way around this time, and Ed is lying, uh, then that it makes cool. more sense because, and that makes sense to me, right? Because Ed died with me, and you could kill two good players. Aleo, I have a question. Hit me. Um, I'm going to claim what you claimed to me, but it's very important for my information. Are you the steward? Yes. Okay. Interesting. Uh, so, are both Jacko and Ed claiming Plague Doctor? Seems like yes. it. Sounds yeah. like it. Second call for nominations. Yeah. I'm like, uh, Avery nominates though. Milk. Which is fine. Avery nominates Milk. Tell us why, Avery. Um, a hunch, a feeling. Milk is just a minion. Uh, with my juggler information, if we're thinking Malachan might be evil or might be drunk or whatever we're thinking Malachan is doing. Uh, I still need to get my juggler information to match up, and one of the ways it could be is if Milk is the Scarlet Woman, who is just hiding behind a goblin claim. Just a thought. Resnora, has your webcam just gone down, or has your chair gone up? It, my desk. Uh, <laughs> my desk goes up and down. Your desk goes up and down! Yeah. What kind of sci-fi world do you live in? That's insane! <laughs> It's common. It's I was common mesmerized by that. It's common. It's not common. It's so it I also have a standing desk. Wow. Am I just living in Victorian times or something yeah, with yeah. my shitty yeah, non-moving yeah. desk? My <laughs> well, desk sorry. lifts up and down if I uh, gain like 200 pounds of arm strength and then lift it. <laughs> that was amazing. I didn't know such a thing existed. Anyway, sorry, Milk. I'm taking up your time here. I'm buying uh, your time right. here. Go I'm for it. I'm just going to say that I'm the goblin and move on. Okay. Milk is apparently the goblin. Head. Five votes if you disagree. I think both sides of the Plague Doctor double claim voted for Milk yesterday. Uh, I, Dreamer info, Milk's not the goblin. Yeah, I I got a two, and the only people it could be is Alejo and Malashan telling the truth, or Alejo and Milk enough. telling me the truth as a Scarlet Woman. 
Oh, I think we should uh, execute Malachon. Yeah. I'll oh, nominate Malachon. Malachon. Okay, I think Ekin was in there first, nominates Malachon. Tell us why. Um, Juggler info, other info um, suggests Malachon might be evil. Malachan? Uh, well, Milk's not the goblin because I'm the goblin. So, like, you should kill me. Okay, Malachan claims goblin. <sighs> I think they're actually. I think they might actually be the goblin. You know, Malachan is definitely the goblin. Milk is a scarlet yep. woman, and we've got to find the little monster or whatever. We also, have he's not we also have... Wait, Avery, what was your juggle? My juggle was uh, Ed as the soldier, which they're not. Uh, Malachon as the engineer. Milk as the scarlet woman. Aleo as the steward. Jacko as a librarian. Jacko is not the librarian. I won't believe it regardless. Ed is not the the, the soldier. Malachon is claiming engineer and could be, but that's iffy. Aleo is the steward, or at least claiming so. So between Malachon and Milk, there is either an engineer or a scarlet woman. Yep. I'd say that's probably pretty accurate. I mean, Milk is a scarlet woman. So, I will say... I mean, I am uh, now. Sadly, tomorrow I won't be. Yeah, I will say that a dream of not goblin doesn't necessarily mean they don't have the goblin ability. We have dead witch doctors. Uh, play doctors. Final call. Yeah. Still no one on the block. Yeah, I mean, we need to just start killing evils, though. I, we... uh, uh, but I think that that's those are the only two evils. Resnora nominate. nominates Malachi. Okay, Resnora, tell us why you have nominated Malachi. Um, based on claims I have from other people, Malachi isn't what they claimed. Uh, therefore, Malachi might be evil. Okay, Malachi. Well, that's because I'm simply just a goblin. <laughs> Malachi claims goblin. <laughs> <laughs> Five votes required. Just a humble, everyday goblin. Just your garden variety goblin. I think we kill it. I don't, yeah. Yeah, I think there's enough to just. Yep. If neither Ed nor Jacko are backing off uh, Plague Doctor, then we have six is enough. The three evils. It's just going to be a crapshoot. Yeah. yeah, and Malachi probably isn't evil, and therefore is going to die because they claim Goblin. <laughs> Jack yep. Or I am evil, and I got the Goblin ability because of the Plague Doctor. I hate I'll it. Nominate. We'll, we'll <laughs> find out. So, what was that, Ekin? <laughs> I already nominated. I was going to nominate myself, but I somebody wants to nominate Ekin. Who said that, sorry? Oh, I'll nominate Ekin. Uh, Milk, tell us why I've nominated Ekin. I'm a helper. Uh, I'd like to help the town as much as possible. Um, so, yeah, there you go, Ekin. Get nominated. Ekin. Appreciate you, Milk. Um, if we think Malachi is the goblin um, and we want to tie this, I'm happy to tie it. If people suspect I'm evil, I'm happy to die. Um, that's all. Okay, seven to execute, six to tie. I think I think the Dreamer should check Milk again. There was a... There was a demon changed last night, which means that we've probably got a uh, thing in now. Oh yeah, I, I, I'll get I'll get that for you, I can... Oh, wait a minute, I'm very... Or it's not yet, enough. But I'm dying, so... Look, this, this could be fine. This absolutely could be fine. Yeah, maybe you should have the goblin, Malachi. Calling it in five. <laughs> four. I mean, three, they're killing all the people who claim goblin. Two. One. Malachi is executed and dies. Everybody goes to sleep. Well, this is turning into a disaster. That was a, a day. <laughs> um, I mean, I don't think I've ever seen an entire evil team claim Goblin in one day before. <laughs> I'm just realizing that I think I have, um, and it was in a playtest game with the Plague Doctor. Uh, so, <laughs> well, there you go. Then it must be similarly. Must, none of us were the goblin. Must be uh, a signature but, of this. Uh, of this. Well, yeah, it's you know, it's that's what happens. You put a plague doctor in and kill him, and all of a sudden, everyone's a goblin. It's just, uh, yeah. This is so, why we're so excited about this character. Yeah, we sh so. we sh we should visit Malashan first, but they've disconnected, so we might as well get Ekin's pick from them. Yeah. See what they do. All right. Hello. 
Hello. Who would you like to choose, Ekin? <sighs> I don't. I don't know nothing about Jojo, Bunny, or Resnora, so I think I'm gonna pick into one of those. Um, I'll go with. Although Avery is claiming jug, spent juggler, so I think it would be good to come from that. Um, yeah, I'm gonna pick Avery. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Avery, it is. Thank you. Thank you. All right. That's good for us, I guess. Yeah. It'd be interesting to see if Malachan chooses to poison Ekin. I do think they know what Ekin is. <clears throat> um, yeah. Yeah. I think Samantha would be the better poisoning. Honestly. Uh, because I think if Samantha's going to pick Malachan and Malachan, then we'll... and then we show Engineer and Goblin. Yeah. Every single time. Yeah. The problem that we currently have is that Malachan is disconnected and yes. that has completely stopped anything that we can do during the night phase. Yeah, but that's that's fine. Um, we can just... <laughs> well, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a little note to myself hats. now. If the following banter isn't amazing, make the cut for the YouTube video here, Ben, and then maybe make a nice <laughs> little transition between the two. Oh, look, Marshawn's back. Fantastic. Okay, let's get them in here. Hello. Hello, Malashan. Who would you like to poison? Um, I will poison Samantha, please. Samantha it is, thank you. Yeah. Alright, phenomenal. That was the right choice. Excellent. Uh, we do I the little that. monster vote now, right? Yeah. Let's find out who will hold a little baby. Milk is pointing at the dead Malachi. Ah, good. <clears throat> this is the part of <laughs> of the night. Well, Malachan and, and Malachi have both pointed at Milk. This is the part of the night where if this were a real game, I would be staring at Milk and giving him a very stern <laughs> well, Wow, they're pointing at Ekin. Really? <laughs> <laughs> oh, because there's a scarlet movement. No, 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 no. That does make sense. Yeah, okay. That that's a good sense. shout. Oh, okay, okay. Funny. Amazing. All right. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> this is so good. Let's go tell Akin that he's got a little bitty. <laughs> okay. Hello, Akin. Hello. Ekin. The uh, pit hag has reared their ugly head. No, just kidding. Uh, we came to tell you that you have the baby. What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> really? Yes. <laughs> Someone has a sense of humor. I mean, you have you. you had one baby, and they decided that <laughs> yeah. you know, why have one baby when you could have two babies? Satan's so dropped off a baby. second one for you to uh, yeah. foster. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Satan. <laughs> we, are, we are Satan. We come bearing child. Uh, enjoy. Uh, thank you. Okay. Cheers. All right. Okay. Uh, my opinion is that we should witch curse Resnora. Ooh, oh, interesting. Ekin wants to chat, apparently. Hang on. Oh, okay. Hello. Sorry, um, do I have a marionette? Uh, I forgot we have not told you that there is a marionette. Okay, great. <laughs> that would have been very useful to you, wouldn't it? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'm glad that isn't there. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Thank you. Sorry, go on, Jams. Oh, I was just going to ask if Rez nominated yesterday, because I don't yes. think... Did yes. they? Okay. Rez nominated um, uh, Malachi, I believe. No, that wasn't Res. They did definitely yeah, I, nominate. It was late, though. It was. I think you're right that it was um, that they nominated Malachi, but it was quite late in the day. I have a feeling that Samantha will nominate. Um, yeah, that's a good point, actually. And Samantha's quite powerful, and yeah. it's all hands on deck for helping the evils out right now. So, yeah, let's witch curse Samantha. I like that. Okay, cool. Um... Great, and let's let's talk about what we're gonna show Samantha before we go to wake her up. Um, I think Ekin is gonna come out and say it's Little Monster, and I think everyone's gonna believe that. So I don't think we should ever show a Vig. Um, yeah, if it's Malashan, it's Goblin or Engineer, right? I think for literally every player, we just show Goblin, no matter what, as the evil role. Yeah. Um, the real question will be for the other players. What role? It, maybe if it's a good player, pit show hag? pit hag because yeah. they already know pit hags in place. So that's not giving them more information. Honestly, um, I think yeah. If it's evil, yeah. it's their bluff plus goblin. If it's good, it's their character plus pit hag, right? Do you know what milk is bluffing? I don't think milk is bluffing anything. 
<laughs> I think that's part of the um, problem. <laughs> oh, we already showed Night Watchmen on Milk, so that's fine. Um, I think I I'm thinking because I kind of I like the idea. Well, let's see. I suppose Ekin would have been told who the marionette was. I guess if or do you tell? I don't think you would if you get the baby. You learn who the marionette right. is because you are the demon. Yeah. Do you? Okay. Yeah, and you learn who the king is and all that stuff as well. You do on the first. Yeah. Okay. I don't like that. I want that to be changed. Um, <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let's um, let's get some answers. No, no, no. That's good. Yeah. Let's do it. Hi. Hello. Hello. Who do you want to pick, Samantha? I'm going to go with Avery, actually. You choose Avery. Yeah. And you learn that Avery is either the juggler or the pit hag. Okay. Great. Thanks. You're welcome. That's right. actually a kind of useless choice for Samantha. Yeah. Who was poisoned, so I figured we might as well show the truth. Yeah. I'm 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 it. guessing Malashan's probably gonna perma poison Samantha. So a little bed of truth and then some lies later. This is gonna be good. I, I'm excited to see what happens with um with Ekin tomorrow. Yeah. Hope you don't mind me making that executive decision, by the way. <laughs> no, 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 that's fine. I think it's I might have said drunk, but I think what's tricky is that as soon as Ekin comes out. Um, yeah, I, I think the yeah, we'll we'll figure it out. What's nice is that there's going to be unaccounted nights of pit hagging. Um, so I think it's reasonable to assume that somebody good might have become a drunk yeah. at some point. So we can, if if Samantha continues to be poisoned, we can lean into that. Okay, um, this has been another yeah. very long night. I think we both agree. We good to... is still winning, right? <laughs> yes. Okay. <laughs> All right, let's get Jojo in here. Okay, Jojo. We we still believe good are winning. Yeah, all right. Can I tell you a fun fact, Jojo, about um huh? uh, Okay, so the word good, it starts with the same two letters as the word goblin. Uh -huh. So, on that note, uh good is winning the game. That's our consensus <laughs> that we've come to. Uh, and that's all Yeah, good good win. Good win goblin. These are these are words that have things in common. Um So in I have a yes. question. Do you sort of take the town's temperature into account when you're uh, uh, giving these things? Like, in the sense that, like, we've been talking a lot that milk is not actually the goblin. Uh, we do not have a thermometer, so it is irrelevant. <laughs> I, I no will generally... Like, yeah, I can't speak for jams, but generally speaking, I will combine the mechanical situation that we're in with what I believe is the me meta situation that we're in and use so both like, of those. If we were on general. the verge of executing a goblin, you wouldn't say good. You might make No, I would definitely evil say evil in that situation. Okay. Yes, All right. If you'd like a serious answer. That There's is, a serious you know, answer and now it's time a serious answer. And, for yeah. a serious moment. What Ben said. Good morning, everybody. Avery died in the night. Oh no! Why would Which I ever? Oh, uh, public safety announcement. Um, I'm holding the baby. Oh my oh. god! <laughs> okay, so uh, no, that, I'm done. No, this this is good. Um, I'll tell you why in a minute, Ekin. Jack, yeah, uh, yeah, let's okay, so Scarlet Woman. Kill Ekin. Oh, I got a good today. I agree. We should kill Ekin. Well. I'm so confused. Evil team chat, let's go. This is so good, Ekin. We win the game, right? <laughs> this is how we win the game, right? We just win the game because we kill you. I mean, Milk's still alive, unfortunately. So that That's rough. But we just, I win, mean, we just win. Milk's Milk's going to catch it tonight, and he, they cannot we kill, move it after we just kill Milk tomorrow. The, we'll, we just kill Milk tomorrow. Yeah. So. And even if Milk has the goblin ability... Which is a possibility. Good wins tie, so it doesn't matter. We win the game. Yay! Right. All right. Oh, this is a wild game, Ben. How dare you? This is wild. <laughs> uh, all right. Well, thank you, Ekin. Thanks. Okay. Oh. That's weird. <laughs> Anyways. Uh, uh, yeah. What were you? Dreamer. Okay. What info did you get? 
Uh, Milk as either the Scarlet Woman or the Night Watchman. Okay. And then uh, Ekin as either the Lycanthrope or the Pit Hag. Okay. Um, your Night 2 info was drunk? <sighs> Why? Yep. How? Wait, because how? A, philosoph- a philosopher turned into the Dreamer. Uh... <laughs> Okay. Are you the um, said philosopher? Uh, I may or may not be. <laughs> Samantha, why? <laughs> yeah, 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 I'm the dreamer. Uh, the feeler dreamer. Um, uh, well, to be fair, nobody claimed dreamer to me, and I needed to find out if milk was the fair. So. Okay, what? Hello. 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 Um, <laughs> based on our conversation on day one, Bunny. And the fact that Jacko just claimed to me to be librarian confirmed. I'm guessing you're the librarian. Yes. Great. Okay. Um, Rez, I'm pretty sure Bunny is good. Bunny, I'm pretty sure Rez is good. Um, I don't know what what you guys are thinking. Uh, Ekin has claimed to me. I think Ekin is telling the truth uh, for a couple of other reasons. Um, So from my point of view, the fact that the evil team have given the baby to someone I think is good means that they do have a Scarlet Woman, which means we have to kill Milk. Okay. Seems fair? Um, yeah, I'm into it. I don't mind. <laughs> yeah, this is fine. I mean... Okay. This is fine. <laughs> cool. fine. I love that people just like, Shh. yeah, I mean, we, we, I, we just wanted to kill we Milk. We do anyway. all agree, yeah, that Milk <laughs> is evil. So, yeah. yeah. Okay, cool. It's cool. one of those things where, assuming that, I mean, if Avery's the drunk, this is just the most buggered situation we could be in. Um, <laughs> but assuming that Avery was sober, um, then we we know where a Scarlet Woman is. The fact that the baby's been given to not evil means that there is a Scarlet Woman and we just have to murk them. Go to the Scarlet Woman, right? So yes. So it's probably yes, better it to does. kill you first. I, I think so. Um, what were you? Like, what's with the Plague Doctor double claim? Oh. Twilight play doctor, and amusingly, the librarian saw both of us. So um, I was oh, just like, "Sure, funny. I'll go with it." And then I got killed first, and then Ed got killed. So that's why that was such a long night. Okay. Yeah. So hold on, um, Philo. Oh no, is that the wrong order then? Because you died. No, it's, the, it's the right the... order to get two firings of it. <sighs> <laughs> Not the right order for the good it's team, Jack. The, correct, but for content, <laughs> it's the best order. Like, why, else, why else would I claim something that I'm definitely going to get executed on? <laughs> okay. Um, so, what do you think they gained? They gained Pit Hack, for sure. Yeah, absolutely. Um, I don't know what else they gained. Um, it could be a marionette somewhere. Um, yeah, that, that sucks big time. Um, Alright. Wait, how does Witch work? Oh. They just pick somebody, and then if they nominate, they die. The storyteller picks who is cursed. Is that how that works, Ben? Yeah, Which that's exactly that how that works. Same for Pit Hag, same for Poisoner. Right. Of Ooh, that's fascinating. That's that. amazing. Um, okay. Yeah, so we might randomly have somebody die. All right. Anyways. Hopefully you it's you for the baby. <laughs> All right. <laughs> <clears throat> Jacko, you're not the fucking Philo. Why you, why, really? you, why you just keep lying? How dare you? you might Welcome as well back, everyone. Roll, Jacko. Jacko, Seven players we're alive. We're going off of a, we're going off a wrong assumption. All votes required. Nominations are open. I nominate Milk. Samantha nominates Milk and dies. Okay. Tell us why, Samantha. Here's the thing. <laughs> uh, if Ekin really is a good player holding the baby, we still have to kill the Scarlet Woman first because the minions will be able to... I just checked with Jams. The minions would still wake up tonight and decide which of them uh, hold the baby. So it would still be a 50-50 tomorrow between Milk and Melishon. So we really need to kill Milk today. I was the Philo Dreamer who checked Milk on day two. Uh, If Malachi was the actual Dreamer who checked Milk on day one, both of our information matches. Uh, Milk is still just the Scarlet Woman. So we really need to kill Milk today. Can I check with Jams on that ruling that it is Yeah, accurate? I just checked with Jams, but yeah. I I need to hear it from Jams because yep. the the way that I've been taught is if the Scarlet Woman gets the little monster past to them, they have to hold it that night. So they wouldn't be able to turn it around. Yeah. 
So, uh, gems. It, how is it ruled? <laughs> yeah, the way that we're running it is that if a Scarlet Woman captures the little monster, then the minions will still wait to decide who holds the baby, because that's part of the little monster ability. Okay. This is a uh, jinx that is one on my list of one of the ones that I want Yeah, to that's interesting. It's, I usually run it the other way, but I'll, I'm happy yeah. to roll with Jams' as ruling. As long as you're consistent, that's really all that matters, isn't it? But I think what we can all agree is that the little monster really needs uh, an almanac entry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if only someone could <laughs> You know what? You know what? I think it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> you should just release it. It's just a little monster. Be consistent. Yeah. That's the entire entry. <laughs> <laughs> yes and do. <laughs> yes. Okay, cool. it's, it's just it's just a picture of me and Steve just doing this and going. And it just says "good luck" underneath. Wait, <laughs> what's amazing about that is that I literally have about ten of that picture of me and Steve in India, just going right next to two grams. So yeah, we'll okay. say Vegas. Milk, your defense. Uh, I tried to give the baby to a dead player last night. That's all. That's my whole defense. Love it. Very dark. Okay, three votes required. Jojo, if you're good, you should really vote on that. No goblin claim. Yeah, no goblin. I, yeah, yeah, I'm not I mean, there goblin. are two different dreamers confirming that Milk is the Scarlet Woman. Yeah. Uh, yeah I, I was only like concerned... People. I was only concerned about that because if Milk is the Scarlet Woman and could also have the goblin's ability. Sure, so sure, sure. if Milk claimed goblin, I would not vote on that. Well, the problem No, is, I know. If, I if know Milk's, what the, uh... Yeah, if Milk's got the Scarlet Woman, and then the, the, the storytellers can't give Milk the goblin ability because that's just a, an evil win no matter what. So yeah. I was not able to get the goblin ability. I mean, uh, in the final three, storytellers have, a, I think the storytellers that... have a different ability. Yeah. In the Any final three, we can execute Milk no matter what. Yeah. But like, yeah. just execute Milk no. Yeah, I mean, I think that they gained the witch ability is my... It's my guess. Yeah. That's well, my so guess. I don't, know why, I don't know why you would think that. Call it five. There were a lot of people that nominated <laughs> Four, day one. Uh, three. Why I think that. Two. One. Milk is executed and dies. And everybody goes to bed. Okay. Four oh, players happy. left. This is That's winnable fine. for evil. Um, I'm just double checking an interesting interaction um, that I don't think has a proper ruling at the moment, uh, which is what the deal is with a little monster and a lycanthrope. Oh, we have an ad. <laughs> Do we? Oh, okay, we're gonna we're gonna let Ed in, are we? Hello, Ed. Hello. Just a quick question: um, Are you sticking to night order as written? So we were just discussing that. Uh, why do you ask? Uh, lycanthrope before or after Little Monster Babysitter. Yes, yeah, we I mean, are literally in the process of deciding the, that because yeah. I just well, double checked and I don't think... Oh, yeah, I'm curious. What would maybe you... just keep that to yourself for now, Ed, until tomorrow. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I, I, I personally run the ball at the same time. Yeah, um, that's how I do too. Um, yeah. But I was curious because, yeah, that's it's a weird one. It's almost like... Who, uh, who put all of these on one it, script? It's almost like it's the little monster should never be released and it's just terrible <laughs> to try and deal with. <laughs> Definitely but, needs but, to work. But, 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 little baby in a hat? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know, right? That makes cute. it well worth it. <laughs> it's the it's merchandising opportunities alone made it worthwhile. Mm -hmm. I Absolutely. blame Amy for a lot of things, and this is one of them. Bye! <laughs> okay, here's what we should Excellent. do. We should go see what Ekin does. Well, first of all, yeah, let's just go get Ekin's pick before cool. we... If Ekin asks us oh, that wait, question... Wait, wait. If e Ekin's going to ask us that question, for the fun of the game, my thought is that at the end of the day, the baby just sort of like goes back to its crib. And no one has it, if that makes sense. Like that's yeah. how I've always thought of it. Um, I just I don't think it's fun for a lycanthrope to be able to end the game. I think that's yeah, not gonna be like, I agree. no one on good is gonna be like, oh yay, like Ekin, you killed yeah. yourself. That's like, not gonna be a satisfying like, oh, win for okay. any of those yeah. guys yet, yeah, totally. And we want this to be fun. So yeah, okay. I yeah, I'm very happy so to say it. if you are the lycanthrope and you target yourself, like you don't have the baby anymore, basically. Yeah. Okay, well, by if that's the time the case, you pick then... the baby has been returned to its home. Let's go speak to Malachan first, then. Okay. Because this might negate all of that. Hello. Hello. Hey. Who would you like to poison, Malachan? Uh, myself. 
yourself. Okay. Uh, I I think you should ask me how uh, the marionette works in uh, with with a uh, plague doctor, Malishan. Um, how does the marionette work with a plague doctor? Well, one one of the uh, one of the the current, especially if they're uh, if it's a little monster game, the person babysitting the little monster, one of their neighbours would become a marionette. So it's entirely possible that uh, whoever's been babysitting little monster initially, one of their neighbours could uh, could be the marionette. I'm just gonna. Just going to put that information out there for you, Malishan. Keep that in mind. Okay. Good to know. Thank All you. right. Thank you. Just wanted to remind love, love Malishan. That, love that gentle. That's the like very autistic part of my brain was like, but Malishan knows that he wasn't told that there's that they were told that there's a marionette. Like obviously, like oh yeah, we're, we're there. We got there. Yep. It is completely uh, possible that they could convince Resnora to babysit the game to its conclusion. <laughs> In it fact, let's let show. Could. Yeah, uh, let's see what Mekin does. Great. Hello. Hey, Hello, Mekin. Uh, do I get to pick can... still? You do get to pick. Uh, you do. Okay. <laughs> um. So Georgia specifically asked not to be picked. Um. So I'm between Bunny and Resnora. Um, I think I'm gonna just randomly pick um, heads, Resnora, tails, Bunny. Uh, spin a coin. Okay. Dun, dun, dun. Just flip the coin. Dot com. I thought all okay. the, I thought all the gambling was happening in Vegas. <laughs> it got heads. Um, so Resnora. So you should go with the opposite of what you've rolled, Ekin, to give you agency. What do you think? Um, nah, I'm gonna go with. <laughs> okay, Resnora is. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you. Shit. Oh, I. <laughs> <laughs> this has been a disaster. I don't think I've ever run a game that where it's been this <laughs> this much of a train wreck, well, no, but and it's still thing. going it's, amazingly. It's, it's still going. Yeah. And I, I mean, it depends, right? Because I think if. Like, maybe they all know it's Malishan. I don't know if they're willing to kill for it on Final 3. I also think they're, or sorry, on Final 4, there's a very realistic chance that they question whether Malishan is the goblin. Um, not that that really matters, because if that's if they're that confident that those three are the evil team, then they're killing Malishan anyways. But, you know, we've made it this far. There yeah. are going to be four players alive, and we should wake up our minions to do some uh, baby pointing. Let's do it. Oh, JoJo is a good choice. JoJo is a very good choice. <laughs> that's oh, fun. please pick JoJo. Come on, Malachi. I pointed JoJo. Please pick JoJo. Malachi, point it right now! Yes! Excellent. Alright, let me move these cameras out of the way. Consensus. <laughs> oh, now Malachi's pointing at Malachi. There we go. Alright. Cool. Phenomenal. Alright, let's wake up JoJo. I really like that they've only given the baby to players with literal babies. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I wonder if that's deliberate. I hope so. But if not, that's also amazing. Hello, Jojo. Hi, Jojo. Howdy. Um, so we noticed that you had a baby, and we thought it would be more fun if we also brought you a baby so that you had two babies. Uh, and one of those babies is the little monster, which is now yours. <laughs> one of them is bold, and one of them is wearing a hat. I'll take the hat one, please, and thank you. <laughs> okay. You're, You're welcome. very welcome. Thank you. Okay. Good. Now we have to decide what we're going to say to Jojo. <laughs> I haven't got a clue. Yeah, I forgot about that. <laughs> I haven't um, got a clue who's winning. <laughs> I'm so confused. Literally anything could be happening right now. <laughs> I mean, I feel like we have to show good, but it's so fun. Like, I think if I was running this game in person, I would just pull up a picture of a baby on my phone, wake <laughs> up the general who was holding the baby, and just show them the picture with the biggest <laughs> grin on my face. Just be like, this is your baby. <laughs> Baby, there it is. Like, that's, <laughs> that's all you can do. Um, yeah, I, th I think, you know, we're, we're gonna, it's good. Good's winning this game. Yeah, I think we've got to pick a witch target as well, and I can't really look oh, past Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. That's fun. Um, should we, oh, but I don't think Malishan will nominate 
but how fun would it be if we witched Malachan? Oh. And they nominated, and the game ended. Like, the confusion, it would be, it, it's not worth it. Um, this is our last witching, because it's yeah. Final Four. I think it's got to be so, Ekin. Ekin is actually going to nominate today. I don't think Bunny will. Bunny might. Yeah, I think... There's part of me that just wants to be like, screw token integrity, whoever nominates should die! Yeah, <laughs> but yeah I know, right? It's worth noting that, that if Malachan does thing. die, the game won't end. Yeah, which is excellent. Um, and part of why I kind of think we should, which, no, I mean, like... <sighs> Problem should. is, everyone knows Milk's evil, so everyone will work out that Jojo is Marionette, even though Jojo isn't Marionette. Oh, that's an interesting point, because the poison has been really hidden. Um... I, th I, yeah, think, I think I think, I think we Ekin. do which Ekin. Yeah. I think that's like if we want to actually help evil that's the best bet although it would be incredibly funny for Malachan to nominate <laughs> and die and for them to then have to figure out like what the deal is I do think they would get to Jojo in part because of that marionette reasoning yeah, um, I think so too yeah um, but gonna tell Jojo good then oh I really want to witch Malachan <laughs> Yeah, good. let's let's tell let's tell them good. <sighs> Hello, Hello. Uh, I am still. Well, we are still of the opinion that good are winning. Oh, you think? I do. Are you, right. enjoying your, are you enjoying your baby? Well, I am. <laughs> Thank you very, very much for asking. All right, bye bye. <laughs> okay, uh, right. Res Nora died in the night. Wake everyone up. Let's do it. Here we go. And that's what gets Malachan to sleep on the couch. That comment right there. Okay. Well, there's Nora sleeping on the ground. In the ground, specifically. Because they died in the night. What? So he was... Uh, oh, Lycanthrope uh, kills Soldier. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So I'm holding the baby, obviously. Oh, yeah, uh, we see, it. We see the, the, the No, no, the Scarlet Woman can't work. Uh, let's just kill me. It's yeah. all alive. Specifically, can we kill you with everyone nominating? Like, all just... of us nominating at once? Well, no, just no, because I just I want to give uh, Ben and Jams the satisfaction of another witch girl. One more witch death. One more witch death. Sorry, what? What did you call us? <laughs> I called you Ed. something rhyming with itch. You can make your choice. <laughs> <laughs> they called you a bitch. Is it your Jojo? Can it be Jojo? I really want it to be Jojo. Jojo can. Oh, I JoJo bet that I'm witch girl. Did you just nominate yourself? Oh yeah, Jojo nominates Jojo. Well, yeah, hang on a minute. Do, do you want to discuss it a bit first, guys? Come on. <laughs> no. Got a oh, whole know. twenty you know minutes of stream know. left. <laughs> let, let's let let's let's put the, let's put forward the evidence. Uh, Alejo, the steward, saw me as good. Yep. Jojo nominates Jojo. <laughs> 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 Jojo nominates Jojo. Tell us why, Jojo. Mm, not witch cursed cowards. Okay, two votes required. God. This is the meanest let's, let's town. All the dead ones. <laughs> oh, yeah, there it goes. Everybody, oh, everybody, oh, everybody, oh, everybody, everybody call it let's on go. this. Go. Jojo. Oh, no. There's no way Jojo people would. There's no the way Jojo people would. The one time I wanted a high five. Actually hold on to the baby. Well, guys, I don't the think we're going to top that. The one time Alejo doesn't high five. And I was the marionette all along, idiot. Jojo, do you want to know something fun? I actually saw Malachi. Would, uh, would would anyone what? else like to nominate them? <laughs> Did you really, Alejo? <laughs> In that case, I don't know then. if you all heard Ben because a lot of people were talking. Would anyone else like to nominate? Uh, <laughs> Malashan will nominate Malashan. Yeah, we're good. Okay, Malashan nominates Malashan, and nothing happens, and the countdown uh, goes. I told you, Ben. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm the you should kill me instead. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh no, my dead vote. I'm sorry, I can't help. Oh you. no. Uh, but he's gone rogue! Look as much for me that I'm the marionette, so uh, I've, I fucked it. Alright, with four I never told you you were the marionette. Incredibly close <laughs> to 11. Not Come on, Bunny face. and Ekin. Just nominate yourselves. Let's just. Uh, let's, or right, just nominate. Let's, 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 kill. Kill. let's put this old dog down. You know what? No, let's not give him dies. The game is over, and the good team has won in what has to be one of the most chaotic character reveals I've ever seen in my life. Oh my God. That was just... <laughs> I don't even know how to begin to describe that. Um, where to start? Uh, we'll kick off with... 
Let's kick off with Ed, the Plague Doctor, uh, who indeed yeah. died died on night one when Malachi the Pit Hag decided to create a Lil Monster. Uh, that turned Malachan, who was our starting Vigor Mortis, into the Poisoner, uh, and the evil team was rounded off by Milk the Scarlet Woman, which is why they knew they could make Ekin the Babysitter. Uh, Ekin the Lycanthrope got a kill every night, except for the night when deaths were arbitrary, of course. Uh, that included last night killing Resnora the Soldier. Uh, we had our empath, Jacko, who got a 1 on night 1. That, of course, was Malachi. Jacko is sat next to Bunny the Librarian, who on night 1 was told either Jacko or Ed was the Plague Doctor, and both of them agreed that they were the Plague Doctor for some reason. <laughs> and it was perfect. It worked out. It was a lot of fun. I enjoyed it. Uh, Alejo was the steward who correctly saw Jojo. Uh, as being good, Jojo was the general who learned every night that good was winning, uh, and I, <laughs> because they were winning for the entire game. Uh, Avery was the juggler who got a two. Uh, that was, I think, Milk and Alejo or Jojo. Yes, and that was yeah. Milk the Scarlet yeah. Woman and Alejo the steward. <laughs> and that just leaves Samantha, our philosopher, who gained the dreamer's ability on night two. Uh, that was an extremely rough ride for Evil, and they are to be commended for managing to make it go to a final day. Uh, because they were really struggling for most of that game. You know Most what? Engineer Malachi, and Watchman Dreamer. I'm you know proud of you for being evil. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, you know what? All the bad things I said about oh. that play, you were evil, so it's fine. Yeah. yeah. So Ben, Ben, on night two, Ben came up to me and be like, hey, if you create a demon, we'll definitely kill the Plague Doctor. <laughs> <laughs> I had to do it. We had a because plan, Malachi. There was I know, a plan. But I, I, I knew, okay, to, because I knew Ekin was definitely the lycanthrope, and I'm like, we need to somehow destroy the lycanthrope or else the Plague Doctor's never gonna die. And then, and then Ben gave me the death of the Plague Doctor on a silver platter, <laughs> so I'm gonna take it. I don't mean to shirk responsibility here, guys, but I think... The entire evil team claiming Goblin by the end of the day too might not have been the greatest strategy. <laughs> Including one of them, but one of them told me to juggle them as a Scarlet Woman, and I said, "Okay, bet." Yeah, it works in a world. You know where it, it works in a really good world. We're on day two. I can go. Yeah, I was the Scarlet Woman. Now I'm the Goblin. If everybody else on the team doesn't claim Goblin, and there's not two deaths from a demon change. So it would work in a whole lot of worlds, not that specific one. <laughs> also the world where Malachi turned me into Goblin. For something completely different, uh, Ben and I both have little witch hats. <laughs> yeah, we got little witch tokens. That's yeah. very cute. Very cute. Very cool. <laughs>